hey guys i hope you're doing well and welcome back to another video so this is a very quick tip about placing objects in your levels sometimes you need a clump of meshes and objects in your levels and it's a pain to do it by hand for example when you want to create something like this you can't just copy and paste and use your move and scale and rotate tools to create something like this it's going to be very tedious and almost impossible there is a trick in unreal that enables us to create this much easier and faster let's say that these are the rocks that i want to place in my levels and i want them to look something like this First of all, you need to make sure that they have collisions. So open them up and here in the show menu, hit simple collision. And now as you can see, we have this green area around our object, which means they have a simple collision. If your objects don't have these around them, just open up the collision tab, hit auto convex collision to open up this menu here uh, bump up these values so we have a decent collision around our object and hit apply next we need to select them all drag them into the level move them around so they don't overlap each other and also adjust their scales all right now first of all let's select them all and add them to a folder so it's easier to manage them and next move them up a little create a copy and add a little bit of a rotation so when they fall they don't fall exactly on top of each other and that's it now we need to simulate physics for our rocks so again select them all using your outliner and here in the details tab search for simulate physics and enable this option here now we can here hit simulate and as you can see they drop like this which makes them look natural and believable compared to placing them by hand after you are done with your simulation just uh, keep them selected and press k on your keyboard to keep them in their place if you don't do that and stop the simulation they go back to their default location so after you hit simulate you need to hit k to save their new locations and now when you go out of the simulation they will be placed at their new positions you can of course repeat the process if you want to make them look even better for example you can copy one of these guys here make it smaller add a bunch of copies and repeat the same process so just simulate hit k to save their new positions and that's it the next thing you want to do is to disable simulate so they don't change every time you play the level so here select them all using your outliner and then disable the physics simulation and now you are good to go you can of course use this technique to scatter other objects like books or garbage even in your levels and this is much easier and faster compared to placing them manually yeah that's it guys for this video and i hope this is useful for you guys thank you guys for watching peace out